Oh my goodness. I'm so excited to finally see the finished product. So tell me, the Ritz Nomad, it's the coolest thing in New York City. It's sold out so fast. It's all anyone talks to me about. This is the first resale. Mm -hmm. What is so special about this building? What is so special about this building, Ryan, there are only 16 penthouse condos in the whole building. So only 16 residences. Only 16 residences. That's it. And this is the very first resale. Wow. Okay. Yeah. And why did it sell so fast? It sold so quickly because it is one of the most unique buildings in all of New York where you can actually, as an owner, stay here up to four months a year wow. at your discretion, but the Ritz-Carlton will rent it out for you on a nightly basis when you're not here. So they've legally circumvented the Airbnb laws, which almost next said no other condo building can say. Exactly. Because mm -hmm. the it's a hotel. It's a hotel. They're paying the hotel tax of the city, so New That's York right. City is nice and happy. They are. Amazing. Super cool. And you get access to all of the amenities here, all the hotel amenities. You get cleaning service, room service, all that. That's right. Three Jose Andres restaurants, bars, room service at your discretion. You have your whole set of doormen, concierges. You can get into the most exclusive nightlife and restaurants in the city. They take great care of you here. And then the finishes are amazing as well. Let me show you yes. a little bit about that. No, I'm kind of blown away. But before we get to the finishes, so the unit is fully furnished and it comes furnished. Comes furnished. Okay. So actually to participate in the nightly rental program, yes. you have to purchase it. But look what a great job they did. You have a working TV, you've got you've got the corded uh, hotel phone. That's right. Everything. They call you when your guests are here, they call you when you have room service, they call you and you call them when you need anything. And I should mention there's even a house car, Ryan, to take Ooh. you anywhere you want in the Ooh, city. Where would I go? Exactly. I can see the Statue of Liberty from here. You can. That's what makes Nomad so interesting is it's north of Madison Square Park, but it is also so, so, so central. You can get absolutely everywhere and your views cut straight down the city. It's really, really cool. I feel like it's the crossroads of Manhattan and mm -hmm. you can get to Flatiron, Tribeca, Soho, Lickety Split, or up to the north with our competition on Central Park and yeah. so all Billionaires Row. I think that's who is looking at this unit as well. Now this is a two bedroom. Two bed, two and a half bath. And the square footage is? 1848. Amazing. Mm -hmm. And it's brand new. I mean, this brand is a new poliform kitchens. Oh, okay. Look at the bronze cabinetry. Ryan, we can actually see our reflections and the world trade That's from smart. here. Where else can you do that? Beautiful design. Beautiful design. This is a white quartzite countertop. We have all Mila appliances. So the thought behind this is celebrities or whomever wants to stay at a roughly seven to $20,000 a night. They have access to convection oven, any kind of oven you want, but mostly people can bring their private chefs, Ooh. which really comes in handy when going to MSG. Some of the top talent that performs at MSG, et cetera, exactly. all stay in these apartments. Now I've heard a lot about this building and the primary suites mm -hmm. being so luxurious and the bathrooms, can we see them? They are, please come, come in. On. Mmm, yep, wow. yeah, this is what I heard about. Look how big this it's is. enormous. 10 foot ceilings, Ryan, obviously king bedroom, mm -hmm. king mattress, and everything's just oversized, including the, the view pure, of World Trade Center. The view is oversized. It looks fake because- It does look fake. The pane of glass is so big, but I love, Again, what they did here, that you know, not just the furniture, but the millwork on the wall. So you have kind of these feature walls, Top everything notch. fully, fully built in. And I think too, for an investor mm -hmm. or you know, a, a, somebody who's foreign wanting to own a piece of New York City, you're not gonna be here 12 months out of the year anyway. So why not be in the absolute heart of Manhattan, in the center, in an amazing fully furnished unit that is basically a hotel suite, but you get to use it four months out of the year which is right. pretty amazing. And the rest, they just are renting it out night after night after night. Exactly. I can't really think of a better situation. You're in the heart of the crossroads of Manhattan. Yeah. All the amenities, all the services, they get to know you as a resident because it is the Ritz-Carlton, so extra level of detail. But when you're not here, they are maintaining this to perfection and yeah. renting it out for you. So it's basically all the benefits of owning a real estate investment property is being a landlord without any of the headaches of being a landlord. No headaches, and that's what we're all about. No headaches. There's plenty of headaches 2024, already in New York. no, no headaches. headaches. Well, let's right. keep, I need to see this bathroom. Let's I'm see that say, bathroom. Wow. Ooh. I know, wow. What is this stone? It is Italian marble by Bardiglio Nuvolato. Good job, look at that. Floor to ceiling, amazing pocket doors. I love this hardware. I love that sink. 
The finishes here are beautiful, you know. And then we have a secondary bedroom. We do. Right, with two additional beds, mm -hmm. ensuite bathroom. And if you wanted Correct. to, you could close them off or just rent one per night, kind of. The genius, they thought of everything. So yeah. really high demand, part of New York City. So fashion week, spring, fall, you name it. Yeah. When, the, when the hotel is full occupancy, you can actually stay in your own primary suite, mm. but have the hotel lock off the secondary bedroom and they will rent that out as a hotel room suite for you while you're actually enjoying the whole rest of this apartment that we just walked through. Crazy. Kind of genius. Kind of genius. Mm -hmm. Let's go back to those views though. Let's do it. See, this is what I'm talking about. I mean, this view, I mean, this window, everything, the dining room, this is incredible. That's absolutely right, Ryan. Of course, the views are spectacular. It's one of my favorite things of the building. However, what I love the most about this building is the amenities and everything else that comes with it. Let me show you. Let's go. Welcome. And last but not least, we have the wonderful new Belize rooftop hotel on the 44th floor by Jose Andres. In the clouds is what the new Blues means. I love this building. I love this offering. I love that unit, but I'm actually going to be sad to see it go. Me too, Ryan. Yeah, I don't think you're going to be that sad. Let's cheers to we it. Cheers. <laughs>